Welcome to one more episode of One Step From Eden with me, Brad Pritchard. Um, I've played through every character now, including the shopkeeper. Uh, last run was a pretty good looking win with her. She's a kind of easy character to play, honestly, but still counts. Um, so, with Saffron I have unlocked her alternate kit. I don't like it very much. It's uh, kind of inherently defensive, but... So I could go back to... Hazel and try to win with her first. I think I'll just go ahead with Saffron. There's the still so four characters I haven't unlocked their alt alternate kits for, but we'll worry about that later. So she, her weapon stops, slows time for two You can dodge easier. I don't care about that. I don't like dodging. Um, part of the cards heal HP equal the number of spells in your deck at the start of battle. Um, kind of plays to the opposite of what I normally do, which is go for tightly curated decks. Maybe I'll try to go against my normal type there. And you got the minigun, the whirl, which I don't like because it anchors you. It can do a lot of damage, though. Uh, it's not like crazy, though. 30 times 6. Hit all of it. It's real good. Step Slash, I, not a favorite of mine. And Thunder, which is good value, but not that easy to hit since it takes a little while to cast. Let's just do it. I'll unlock her alternate kit if I didn't win anything. I'm pretty sure I did win. Weird. Okay. Oh, it's because it's Crow now. The different, the different kits do have different uh, indicators for how much you've won, which makes total sense. Oh, a hostage. So, oh, it's still charging, but there we go. And kill. So, World's really nice against the enemies will just stand still. This doesn't apply to that many enemies. I'm not, I'm not going to decide what I'm trying to do here yet. I'm just going to take cards that are generally useful. I do like Magic Claw. Uh, since it does apply fragile, it actually applies 150 damage rather than 120. And leaves one fragile on the enemy. Uh, these other two are crap. So let's just take cards I like and maybe try to use this uh, trinket she comes with. Good work. And I don't really want to go that way. Something killed him, I suppose. Uh, I should have... There we go. That'll do. Don't appear to have saved the hostage, though. Sure. Uh, Bouncing Blade something that I always try to make work and never feel like it really does. But what? You know what? We're taking cards. Taking lots of cards. Or mana regen. Definitely useful at this point. Can I kill this guy in time? No. I would get me close. Yeah, there we go. Hostage saved. The triumph. Could take firewall. They'll take firewall and get rid of step slash. They cost the same, and I like firewall a lot more. Obviously, not really contributing to the goal of having lots of cards, but I don't want that one. Excuse me. Alright, it's just you and me, pal. And, uh, stand there for a second. Nice. Not into it. Uh, swing and a miss. And, uh, minigun should be enough. Both the Saffron's kits, at least the two I've unlocked, they're just way too flexible. Um, tri -reg could work. Minigun is a trinity item, so let's grab that. This... That, that, there we go. And minigun these two things to death. That, my movement was off. Magnifying glass? Sure, I don't have anything that bestows fragile enemies right now, but I can get it. I'm not taking any of this stuff. Mana potion you could probably justify, but I don't like chasing after that thing. Um, what do I want to do here? Oh, the poison. Poison. Fine, run away. See if I care. I do not care. I haven't even had to use the bouncing blade yet. That's a cheap ion cannon. Blue bullets and minigun will both work out on the same principle if I can get some some magic. The piercing's nice. Get some spell power. Give it a try. It's gonna take a lot of cards. Means I'm gonna have to pay attention. This helps with blue bullets a little bit. This is gonna be no, that'll apply fragile to me. I don't really want that. 
I don't like my chances on this run already. I'm already feeling a little uh, skeptical of my success. I'll have to get rid of Whirl at some point. Eventually I just get so frustrated with it I don't want to keep it. That will certainly happen again. Can't do anything from over here. Oh, let that hit me, huh? Can't hit with this lightning, so I'm just gonna chuck it. Oh. Hey, thank you. Yeah, it's really not doing it. She's got a shield up, so it's not really doing much in the way of damage. Ow, 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 ow. Those things really are a bit of a problem when you don't have any additional spell power. They're just they're not that effective. I wanted to go back and toss it again. <laughs> hey, got a third time. Not bad. That guy's spell's not going to work. I've taken so much damage. I'm on the verge of victory, but... That's just not how you do it. But that will do it. <clears throat> I don't know which ending I'm going for either. Um, they all seem kind of unlikely from where I'm standing right now. But I will murder her. Alright, there are limits to the cards I'll take. And just a 3 damage spell that costs 80. Yes, it heals you for 100. But, god, that's so expensive. Miracle doesn't really work for me, so I'll just I'll take the upgrade. Don't have anything that goes with flow. What do I want to upgrade? Actually, Whirl, if I can get rid of the anchor, which is an upgrade, it suddenly becomes worth keeping. You don't have to stand there while, you, while it's going. Um, but I think Minigun would probably be the best one to upgrade right now. Two extra damage to consume. Two shots is really not that much. I don't love any of these, but I guess I'll take this one. It should be slightly better than two shots. It should be on average three shots, so. I know how to divide. No problems there. Uh, yeah, another one where. You always just throw a knockdown, there's just free to cast, but no. Not that desperate to make my deck fat. These are piercings, so that's that's a nice look, I think. That guy does stand still, so that's worthwhile. Yeah, I can't see me taking any of these either. Jam slam. I'm not in a position to make that work. I have to have lots of jams. I've never built a successful jam deck. I had one that did a lot of damage, but it still didn't work for me. Okay, glass cannon is definitely the take here. That'll help my minigun and blue bullets. Oh, well, well. This guy's doing a good job of dodging me. Yeah, I'm gonna hit you a little bit. I'm sorry about that. Not enough to kill you, though. You look appreciative enough. Oh, uh, once again, stuff I don't want. I haven't even chosen to focus. I still, there's nothing specific I'm going for, and I'm just, I'm probably just gonna leave it that way the whole, whole time. I did not do very well with that. Um, yeah, okay. I thought I was gonna get hit, but I didn't. That's probably not a what you call a fantastic use of that particular item. There was a use of it. Bouncing Blade's doing absolutely nothing for me as well, of course. I think I'm going to need this defense. Enemies exploding on death, another thing that doesn't help in boss fights. like things that don't help in boss fights. Back over there. 
crowns for every coin I can get. Um, chances of me doing any frost damage seem pretty limited, but whatever. Take Frostbolt again. The only appeal of Mini Thunder is that it is free. Free to cast. Um, you know what? I'm willing to glut my deck with things that are free to cast, even if they're not particularly good, like that one. Look at its freeness already paying off. Oh, sorry, sorry. Kind of did kill her there. Uh, but let's not go this far. Um, in terms of taking free things, that's not going to do it. Unless you have shotgun. I'm just not seeing that item. Here, take both thunders. I <laughs> gotcha. Ooh. This is poor play. But a good start. Am I going to play this? Yeah. A stop for a heartbeat there. Oops, I didn't mean to shuffle there, but I certainly did, so. My bad. Something hit me there? Um, skeptical. Here. Aw, oh, you move. That's that's the problem with that item. And I missed my big one there. But that was, that was a good fight. Oh, I had no complaints there. Here, bouncing blade to the face. Limit break is not good with what I have as much as I love it. Innervate, I don't really want to add jams. It works with blue bullet obvi bullets, obviously, but nah. Upgrade or shield battery or pants. They're all pretty deep. I'll just take the upgrade. But what will I upgrade? Take the power shard. Could have made a an argument for mana regen. I really th think that the, just the problem with upgrading firewall is that it doesn't do much damage. The damage is from the fire, not from the hit. So that doesn't help too much in a lot of ways. But I'll be able to save it. Um, use it with either blue bolts or minigun. Because I don't think any of that stuff is that valuable to upgrade, honestly. Alright, dumb dumb. Gotta move now. I don't know. Here, bouncing blade. Didn't hit the hostage with it this time, so that's showing some progress. Nothing here that really does it for me either. Something played is a terrible take. I think I'm willing to admit that now. This anchors me. It is another Trinity item. It's only half a second though. Let's go for it. Let's try to build that Trinity a little bit quicker and keep my mana high. I try to remove anchor from it as well. I'm not going to. I'm not going to spend an upgrade on that. Snow boots. I still don't do any frost damage. Those are all big nose, I think. Lecturing, very much only useful in kunai focused decks, and even then, I, I don't believe in kunai deck. It's kind of just like uh, Slay the Spire. I don't think kunai deck's real. Ow. Not sure I needed to be taking hits there. Didn't seem entirely necessary. Well, I have plenty of tools to save hostages, so let's try to save them instead of murder them. Bouncing blades just what I use to kill things after fights. It's not doing me any good. I don't break any tiles. Maybe I will someday. Break some tiles here. Not going to, though. there. That was a good looking fight. Um, played all my cards pretty much right there. I don't have any structures. 
I've never taken this card and I really like to, but I, I don't play that many Hazel runs and you can't take structures if you're not Hazel. It's pointless if you can't repair them and increase their spell power. Alright, let's do this. Oh, I was not in the right position for that. That was embarrassing. I hit the wrong spell, so. Good looking start. Got no damage while she was just standing still doing nothing. I'm sure what you want when you're playing this game. Yeah, stand still during that. That's a good th time also. Alright, I should probably pick up some of the shield. <laughs> yeah, I didn't pick up quite enough of it. Solid damage. Here, get this thing out of my face. How's that sound? He's almost dead. And something killed her. I honestly have no idea what killed her. Which is fine. Here, have this tiny lightning. None of those. Two expensive spells and one spell that I really do believe is bad. <laughs> I want to take it so bad. Um, blue flame? I don't think so, because I want to keep that mana high so blue bullets can... Uh, do better work. I do have two upgrades now, so I'm gonna upgrade the minigun first. Piercing, flow, and see, all right. I guess that's what it's gonna be, piercing. So now both of my high velocity guns have uh, piercing on them. Not great against bosses, but. out in the hall, that's always nice. Defensive item, now. Frost is obviously not my thing. Probably should maybe... Oh, yeah, you're that one? Crap. Um, it, Trinity was ready. Not smart. Just throw that for fun. Utterly untakeable cards. I won't take any of those cards in much of any situation, honestly. <laughs> They're pretty bad. Let's save this hostage. There. Plus 50 hit points. Not that I think I'm going to be sniffing full HP anytime soon. I could take Shine. I enjoy Shine. Alright, I haven't taken it yet in any of these videos, so let's take it. Not amazing damage, but it's good damage. It's something I'd be willing to upgrade to maybe make it cheaper. I moved right into that guy. I've got a plan. Oh, he moved. Plan ruined. Gotta be a little careful here because I don't really want to hit the hostage all that badly. Ow! I'm getting hit by stupid shit right now. Kill that rock. Just in time. Hostage survives. A little HP. Not a very clean fight. I love Fracture, but I don't think I can justify taking it here. Yeah, I do some flame damage from time to time. I want to keep my mana high as often as I can. See, there's, I'm proving that I have fire damage. Oh, you. But, well, that obviously is never... Flame wall will show him what's what. Still love a little more spell power, but um, could get a really expensive fire spell, which is kind of doubling. I don't think that's very effective unless you're going for a true fire deck, which I am clearly not. There's the power of shine. Should have just that, I don't think, but I did. I'm taking damage pretty much every fight, which is not optimal. So there's Brush Fire the Great Nailer. Now I kind of wish I took Firestorm, but I wouldn't be able to keep my flames alive long enough to have all these cards in my deck, so. I'm definitely a little concerned about this fight. I feel that I could perform very poorly in it. 
Oh, she moved. Of course she moved. Why wouldn't she? Uh, no, I'm not going to argue that, that, that taking that damage was worth it. I think that is not the case. <laughs> what are you doing still alive? Just get him out of here. <laughs> there, that was nice. Yeah, that's going to hit me. Was that worth it? I don't think it was. Yeah, I knew that wasn't going to hit, but... Ow. Ow, that hit. Wow, bad timing. Bad timing. Bouncing blade. Still working, I swear. <laughs> as long as he keeps moving into it, and try to get rid of this guy. Help, now it's in the wrong way. Yep. Ragnarok? That was... And... But the shine gets him. I'm going to save her, I think. So it looks like we're going for a neutral ending again. Um, do I really want to go for a neutral I feel terrible about my deck. <laughs> I don't think it's doing hardly anything that's even remotely useful. The wall has a lot of hit points. So I'm not dealing that much damage. But with flame, with flame wall, it's cool. I send a quick text message here. Well, you know what? I gotta just play what's possible to I don't believe the genocide run is winnable in my current anywhere near winnable in my current state, so. No. Oh. Hey, got him though. Sure. Kind of. And do this with good looking damage. Just enough. Zigzag is a card I don't believe in very much. Maybe I should go to the store. Could use some upgrades. Oh, I stood in the exact wrong place there. Um, yeah, I'm anchored. That was unpleasant. I'm so picky as to make this trinket worthless. I guess I should be- I still haven't used my primary weapons, I never do. I'll cast the wrong spell, that's fun for me. Just taking an absolute beating. Rough day at work. Acid rain's kind of fun, um, but you have to stay in one place for a long time, <laughs> which is gonna get me killed real fast. Mana gem. Make those blue bolts a little more effective. It is really just a little more thing about it. I'll fight the boss. I have no. I'm stupid. I don't like how this is going, to tell you the truth. There, I got rid of him at least. He didn't take poison damage, so it's not up. Oh. And these things aren't going anywhere, and they're going right beside me, I didn't notice. Just another complete destruction here. Don't really need the extra mana. Guess it would have got me Trinity. This is fine. Everything's fine. Just took another absolute thrashing. Well, I'm hitting hit all the time. May as well take defense. Not fighting you, that's for sure. 
Okay, none of that looks too good. <laughs> Max HP is not my issue. Let's buy a bunch of upgrades and hope for the best. I'm gonna upgrade Shine for sure. Probably add another something to Blue Bullet. Double cast mana. I can afford it. A lot of damage. 480. Bonus 20 damage is kind of a sweet deal, though. Eggs up to 400 without increasing the price by two. I think that's the play. Whoa. Piercing is worthless. Let's just skip those. And try again. Double cast. Now worth a lot. It's up to 800 damage. I mean, that's a serious damage. That, I could kill something with that. Now, it's not enough to do it again. Maybe I can get a mana cost down. It's gotten very expensive in here. Honestly, wasting all my upgrades on it. So, for one, I would get 200 damage. That doesn't feel doesn't feel right to me. Your thing's nothing, though. Um, no. It is a good deal. 200 damage for one. It doesn't affect my blue bullets quite as much. Save the other upgrade. Saved one of you. I don't think I'm saving you. I can't just be sitting here taking all these hits. Let's get rid of that. Let's just be real cheap about it. Firewall him to death. There's another one. Runs out, we're still fine. I feel like hit points are kind of at a premium for me at this point. Alright, let's see what kind of damage this can do. Nice. <laughs> I liked it. Oops, I'm going to put this right on the front row so that those things just keep getting bashed. Oh, that worked well for me. So, yeah. It's going okay. Don't know why I cast that. Oh, and I missed with my my, my big money shot there. So that's a sh Okay. Yeah, stand there. Oh, wrong button. It's fine. I recovered. Uh, I'll get rid of you quickly enough. Goodbye. Get rid of everything. Figure that shit out. Oh. We go two or three this one. Only two. I mean, man, that's a pretty good spell now. I can hit somebody with it, that's the only problem. Um, I could kill you. I, I want to kill her, because I don't want her, um... Uh, I don't want her appearing in front of fights. I have a lot of things that strike four away. She's not that much of a problem, like she normally is. Just, you know, blocking you from hitting enemies. Nothing there. I mean, the Empower Ring's not bad. With a deck this size, I just can't reliably get it attached to minigun. I'm getting rid of Whirl. Get, get out of your Whirl. I hate you. I don't think I've used you effectively in quite a while. You could also get rid of Bouncing Blade, they're both worth getting rid of. You know, I mean, I've done some stuff with Bouncing Blade. Not nothing. No. So, oh, yeah. Well, whatever's in here, okay? Alright, and now I got this. Oh, he still gets hit some when that happens, but it's not satisfying, that's for sure. Still not really getting enough out of that. Killed him with his own bomb. Probably feels pretty bad for him. Genetic shield? Yeah, sure. I think that helps when I get hit a ton, which I do. This way. It's, it's something! That's gonna hit me, though. Not enjoyable here. Have that. I know you'll be back here in the front row eventually. You can't help yourself. But take a big chunk of my already limited hit points. That's a, a no for me. Hey, right, kitty cat. Yeah, I'll just heal this time. I need hit points. This will do. Almost. We'll almost do. 
No, not those things. I have so many max hit points, but... I'm gonna drop this back here. That seemed to work. Save the hostage. Yeah. 25% chance to hit twice is not the worst thing in the world. Let's take it. When those rare occasions when I get 140 damage out of it, it starts to look pretty good. Good job, Bouncing Blade. So good at killing chests. Uh, I'm a little too late for getting that, but it's to have. This is looking like a big no. Yeah. Ow. Yeah, swing and miss. Yeah, I don't think I ever really built anything particularly real with my minigun and whatnot. Oh, I'm gonna miss. This will still kill. Looking a little bit better in these fights. I do have to definitely think about a lot about which spell I have loaded because a lot of them, by my standards, by not by the game standards. I believe in myself. And this will be a pretty easy hit. Just throw that, who cares? Out, oh, walked right into that one. Got him, though. Got him with the big ticket item. Uh, yeah. Yeah, just stay there. No, didn't stay there. And that was a, a panic cast. And I moved too much. That was perfect, though. Um, I'm gonna, gonna, gonna... Maybe kill him and get, if I get to remove, I can get rid of Bouncing Blade. If not, I can upgrade Blue Bullet, even though it's not doing much for me right now, honestly. Or just play it safe and take the hit points. Take the hit points. I don't want to do something even worse, which is stop at a campsite. It's just embarrassing. Oh, this is no fun. Not enjoy this fight. gotta be a little bit careful. Oh, like, I mean, like I can't stand right there because I was in a bad way. I just... Oh, God. The fuck zapped me? He'll die on his own. Throw these away. Who cares? Yeah, sneeze. <gasps> Sorry about that, buddy. Alright, I'll come with this. Nope. Just a sneeze. It's kind of your fault, you realize. Go to the last store, for sure. Oh, I didn't walk right into it for me. I don't really want to use the minigun against him. More, more of a flame wall type deal. Easy one there. No. Ooh, walked right into that one, huh?
there's my one spell that actually works. I think I, I think taking that uh, I don't know, would have done a lot of damage if I didn't take the one cost thing, but it just seems so worth it. Cheap fissure. It's pretty good against the wall, which I will be fighting. Right. Add more cruft to my deck. I may or may not save you. That's all I can really tell you. I think we're fucking not. Oh, I got her. Thanks, Bouncing Blade. Scales, absolutely. Undertow, no. Oh, I love Energizer, but that's a terrible, terrible uh, upgrade to have on it, and it also sucks in big decks, so. I guess I'll do a Energizer plus Classify run only. Because that is a proven strategy that works. I'm gonna try to play this pretty slow here. Fuck spell. Cover. Yeah, that's gonna kill her. I was afraid of that, but I don't think it, I don't see how that was avoidable. I don't, not really that huge of a fan of shooting blue bullets at these cacti. Oh, and I missed my Ragnarok once again. I think I've hit it once. Whatever. He'll die before he shoots me. I said my spell damage power is pretty good. Probably so. Probably my 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 blue bullets and my minigun are now pretty decent. Uh, the wall tends to have some defense though, which makes it a little dicey. Medkit. Medkit. And last door. I'm gonna get rid of bouncing blade. Plus, there's something amazing I need to buy. Which is definitely not that. This I can do, but. So after this, I don't care about money anymore. So I will do it. But it's, I don't need max <laughs> MP. That's not a thing for me. Store half. Oh, no. yes. That's a good one. I got two more. So I could try to do Fracture or Fissure. Or just two random cards. Do two random cards. that. No longer have the luxury of refusing upgrades. Flying Frost. Bonus damage. I'll take that. No complaints about bonus damage. Now, Shiso, as long as I'm focused, I can do this, right? No, I can't. Oh, jeez. Oh, he just... Oh, God. My deck's gonna be full of jams. It's full of jams. He's doing everything I don't want him to. It's wonderful. Oh my god, there's gonna be 10,000 jams in here! But off to a very poor start. I mean, I'm gonna fire that out while I try to get rid of these jams. Okay, at least I didn't get blasted that time. I got Ragnarok, I'm gonna get blasted. Fight. I'm just not dealing damage, so this is a problem. Any fight where he uses that a lot is a bit of a problem. Jesus Christ. Flame damage kind of working for me. Jams, jams, jams. Nope, move the wrong direction. I think he's done giving me jams, so that'll be a bit of a rest. I mean, honestly, my hit points aren't that bad. Yeah, I light this guy up. He is just hitting me so frequently. There we go, I got some damage in. God, he's just hitting me. Why do I have flow, by the way? I guess because of Fisher. Oh, and I missed. Hey, I finally hit a Ragnarok, though.
and I did something stupid, but I'm going to make him pay for it too. Oh, jeez, did not mean to move in both of those directions. Love how I just sit there. Man. Oh, and he moved out of the way yet again. Wow, that's not good. And that's panicking. He's almost dead. Just survive this. I don't need to win the fight against the walls. Don't lose to Shiso. Got one of them. He got bored, so he's reverted to doing this. Hmm. Couldn't quite get him, as usual. There we go. Oh, that was not good. Not good at all, but he's, he definitely gets to survive because there's no way I'm defeating the wall with uh, those kind of hit points. Uh. Better start moving. I've already lost so many hit points. And I've broken some tiles. That's going to make things a little more difficult for me. Mm, not really the card I wanted there. Here. Looks like it might just be not quite enough. Oh, it is enough. I made it. Whew. That was tense. I'm shocked that I got the win. I'm not convinced I deserved it. My dodging during that fight was highly questionable. Got her with the Ragnarok, though. I really didn't... I, I had no way of killing her. It's not like I was uh, Jiso. But uh, I didn't want to either. It would have been awful. <laughs> I don't want to go through another run with that build. So, uh, another successful staff run run. By the skin of my teeth in this case. Or, uh, unlocks. Shadow Toxin, Kunai's Apply 20 Poison. A lot of Kunai enablers in the last two set of unlocks. You can system gain 12 whenever poison damage is dealt. So, if you can get Kunai, if you can get both of those trinkets together, you're going somewhere. On Soon, which I think is absolutely terrible. And Vino Shock, which is definitely not terrible. Great poison deck enabler. So, I guess that's it for the video. Uh, Made it through one more run, got a little bottom line, bottom line of my triangle right there for Chrono Saffron. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll be back again soon with another video of One Step from Eden. See ya. I wish I, I, wish I had chopped this off in editing, but I'm not going to edit.